Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to be sharing our review for spending an overnight in Coach. Okay, so the first question you may have is why would you do this? Why would you spend a night in Coach when there's other options available? And the main reason is money. Mm -hmm. uh, to get a roomette, which is the lowest class of a sleeper car on Amtrak, it's going to be about $600 for two people mm -hmm. uh, for an overnight. And we basically spent on all the ones we've done between five and $600, and we got those on the uh, two-for-one Amtrak sale, so we got a pretty good deal on that. In coach, however, it's going to be much less. Depending on your route, it's going to be between $75 and $100 per person uh, for the whole route. So mm -hmm. just right there. Going in coach is going to save you a ton of money. If you're just trying to get from A to B or just want to see something, that is one really big reason and good reason mm -hmm. to uh, ride in coach. Yeah, and I think a lot of people get uh, deterred in thinking of like the airline seats and how they're going to be really uncomfortable. Yeah. But honestly, we found it um, to be incredibly comfortable. The seats are way bigger than they are on an airplane. Uh, leg room, you have a ton of leg room. The seats lay back almost all the way back to lying down all the way down so that's fantastic and you also have a footrest that pops up as well to um, not just from the seat laying back but also from the front to put your feet up as well which was really helpful for a short person like me <laughs> whose feet didn't reach all the way to the front so that was really nice too yeah it's almost like being in a business class or first mm -hmm. class on a, on a long haul yes. uh, airline yeah trip so yeah i was very surprised you're not going to be like squished in there for you know 35 or 50 hours um in coach not being able to get mm -hmm. up and move around because the other thing is trains you can get up and you can walk around you can go to the observation car which you have access mm -hmm. to as a mm -hmm. coach passenger um, you can go down to the cafe and get food mm -hmm. you will be moving around some so you're not just limited to staying in that coach seat that you've purchased. Mm -hmm. So in an honest review, you do want to share some of the downsides too. And I think one of those things, which we discovered pretty quickly when we did the overnight in coach on the Sunset Limited, is that um, there's going to be stops in the middle of the night, which if you're trying to sleep, you're going to have a lot of commotion you know, in the middle of the night with people getting on and off the train and getting directions, hey, sit here and all that kind of stuff. Yeah, so. exactly. You're, you're not going to sleep as well as you would in a roomette. There's mm -hmm. just no way because even though in a roomette, the train still stops, no one's coming by your seat or making noise or turning their lights on to try to find their seat exactly. or <laughs> cell phone ringing or something like this. So yeah. um, it is better than a plane, but a roomette is still better if you want to do that. Um, but you can definitely do it in coach. Yeah, and honestly, if um, if you're not doing an overnight, it really doesn't make a ton of sense to get a roommate, um, unless you have you know maybe some medical conditions or something. But it just it just makes a lot of sense to to get coach. You save money. You get almost all of the same benefits very few differences from um the sleeper car passengers and first car pa car passengers so it's really not not a bad thing to save that money yeah it's not bad um the only thing is you won't have access to the dining car you'll need right. to eat in the cafe mm -hmm. or bring your own food which is going to save you even more money because mm -hmm. the meals on amtrak can be a little bit pricey mm -hmm. uh if you're eating those for a couple days in a row so that's just another positive to save you money, but we enjoyed our time in coach. Um, it depends on what you're going to do. If you're going for a, kind of a luxury field vacation, mm -hmm. go ahead and get the room at. You're mm -hmm. going you're gonna to enjoy that more. If you're trying to save a little money, feel free just to go ahead and get coach. Yeah, it's totally doable um, for a one night. I would think it would be a little bit more challenging if you were doing two nights two on the would train. Be tough. Um, but we did the one night and it was it was good it was doable and it wasn't uh, incredibly uncomfortable we had we had a good time <laughs> well I hope you enjoyed this video stay tuned for more Amtrak videos and enjoy your ride whether you choose to be in coach or in a roommate